beast, let out the beast. The Jun Cherokee Alliance, Chapter 2 Naruto groaned as he got up. He didn't get much sleep the night before, since he was so overwhelmed with his thoughts. He had just found out about Kyuubi, so... Oi, rat. Don't blame it all on me. Naruto grinned. Kyuubi was fun to talk to, although he was the most dangerous and strongest demon in the world. I appreciate the compliment. Naruto shook his head laughing and started to brush his teeth. So, Q, what... I am the strongest tailed demon in the world. Why are you calling me by the repulsive nickname of Q? It's easier to say. And, as I was saying, since there are eight other Jinchurikis like me, how about we contact them? Naruto asked. It is a good idea. How am I supposed to find out who the other Jinchurikis are? Jiraiya of the Sun Nin runs an intelligence and information network. You should ask him. I remember your parents complaining about him once. Naruto glanced at his new outfit. Leaving behind the Kill Me Orange jumpsuit, he gingerly picked up the shirt which still had the Whirlpool symbol on the back. His new wardrobe consisted of black ninja pants, which were cut just a bit shorter than to his ankles, an anbu style of black shirt and protector, which was put on his forehead. He had transformed into a generic ninja student and bought it. Lord knows that the shopkeepers wouldn't sell it to him if they knew who he was. Disregarding even the slightest glance at the milk, he went outside without breakfast. He would also blame his lack of groceries on his reputation for, apparently, being the QB. Naruto looked up at the academy and entered. The receptionist glared at him and clenched her fists, as Naruto just smiled at her. Blinking, she shook her head and just turned back to her paperwork. He walked into the room and sat down. Kibo laughed and went up to him. Naruto! This is only for people who graduated. Naruto grinned. Do you see this, Kiba? He pointed to his headband. I did graduate. Kiba gawked. They actually let you graduate? Naruto shrugged. Guess they saw how amazing I was. Rolling his eyes laughing, Kiba and Naruto just smirked. Someone's spying on us. Top left, directly in front of you. Naruto instinctively looked at where QB was pinpointing and gave a glare which could make the four Hokages run for their lives. It was an understatement that he didn't like being spied on. Inside the hole, the ninjas gasped. That's impossible. How could he know we were here? The Hokage puffed out smoke. Naruto's more troublesome than we thought. Kakashi will do well to take care of him. How did the demon see us? Kakashi turned around and glared at the man who said this. Uzumaki Naruto isn't a demon. The Ninetales is. And they are different. The man put his hands up in defense. Calm down, Kakashi. I'm just saying what everyone else is saying. Kakashi rolled his eyes. Well, get it through your thick heads. Hokage turned to him. Good luck, Kakashi. You'll need it with your team. Hi. Kakashi nodded. Back in the classroom, Naruto cursed and put his head in his hands. Damn, QB, you shouldn't have said that. Now they're going to be suspicious. Great job. Don't blame it on me, brat. Too late, Q. Oh, shut it, brat. Don't call me brat. Brat. Seriously. Brat. Q. Okay, okay. People are trying to get your attention and you're blanking them, so snap out of it. Naruto blinked and rubbed his eyes at the sun force and getting out of his mindscape. How? Naruto, are you listening to me? He turned his head and looked at Eno. Nope. Eno's face went red. I said move, Naruto scowled. I'm not doing anything for you. Sakura pushed Eno to the side. Naruto, move. Naruto rolled his eyes, and to think at one moment of time, he actually liked the pink-haired banshee. It was absolutely outrageous. Shut up before I gut you and make it look like an accident, Naruto hissed dangerously. Eno and Sakura went dead silent. Naruto would usually never say something like this. Sakura thought he liked her for Kami's sake. Sasuke eyed Naruto for a minute and decided that he wouldn't worry about it. It wasn't his problem, and it wasn't like he'd be working with a blonde in any way. Oh, the irony. Sakura went silent and just sat down next to him, although slowly edging away from him, believing that he might take her up on his threat. Everyone, you are now ninja, again more specifically, but that is the lowest of ranks, so you'll be put onto teams. And cue a string of curses from multiple genin. Be quiet, I'll announce the genin now. Team 1. He droned on and on. Naruto didn't pay any attention at all until he said, Team 7. Uzumaki Naruto, Sakura Haruno, she felt like crying, and Sasuke Uchiha. Now she felt like singing happiness, while Naruto felt like bawling his eyes out instead. 
Teammate, Inuzuka Kiba, Hyuga Hinata, Aburame Shino. The said shinobi nodded to each other. Team 9 already passed from last year, so Team 10 is Narusha Kamaru, Akimichi Choji, and Yamanaka Ino. Ino glared at the back of Sakura's head. How dare she, Sakura of all people, be put on her Sasuke's team? While Ino herself had to suffer being on the fatty and lazy kid's team, it was stupid and could never work. Soon enough, Sasuke would be requesting a team change and magically end up in Ino's team. The Yamanaka family believed all of this would occur. In her mind, of course. Ha! As if that would ever happen. All of these fangirls are just too past the line of sanity to ever go back. Naruto rolled his eyes at the fangirl's antics, glaring at the smug-looking Sakura. Typical. He laughed out loud and didn't bother to hide it. Iruka looked at him and blinked. Got something to say, Naruto? Iruka asked with a raised eyebrow. Naruto put a hand on his chin and nodded. Yep. And what might it be? Iruka asked curiously. Naruto smirked. Oh look, I'm on the class bitches team. Oh well, at least I get a professional Jonin as my sensei, and guess that would even out the pain. And then he proceeded to shinshin out of the room using the technique that QB taught to him the night before. Hell to the yeah, brat. Oh Nick, just the thing I made for fun. Doesn't affect the actual storyline in any way. Brat. QB, stop. Brat. QB, don't. Brat. Would you just... Brat. Q. Brat. Seriously? Brat, 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 seriously? Brat, 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 Kibi, seriously. Um, Q, you there? Q, you're scaring me. Are you still there? Okay, QB, I'm so sorry. Forgive me. Q? Brat. Oh shit. Brat, 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 br